Hey, what's up everyone? This is Madden 5. Um, a day or two ago, I uploaded a video uh, where I was talking about uh, many things uh, regarding atheism, and a couple of people were buying a dance and all babies are atheists. And this is my, you know, these were some of my thoughts on the whole, you know, fundamentalist atheist or movement atheism, whatever you want to call it. And I got more dislikes than I've gotten in a long time, which, you know, that's fine, whatever. If you disagree with the video, that's fine. I really don't. You know, that's your opinion. Uh, some people put their fucking opinions. I Some people unsubscribed. I gained some subscribers, but, you know, whatever. I'm not here to gain subscribers or, you know, to make everyone happy. You know, if, if you feel like you should unsubscribe, do it. Um, I'd prefer you make a fucking argument. And some people did, and I'm going to be covering some of these. Now, first off, um, All Babies Are Atheists uh, put a comment, and he said, you know, thank you for being so even-handed on this. And, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to be fair. That's what I like to do. Um, I mean, I caught shit for my video where I was attacking some liberal positions. But, you know, hey, whatever. It, it's like, what, you fucking stir up the hornet's nest, you know, some of them are going to get pissed off, whatever. That's fine. You know, I mean, to me, I know what I believe. If you disagree and you feel that fucking strongly, you know, you're, you, God, you're so fucking mad that I disagree with you, you have to unsubscribe or, you know, dislike and all, fine, whatever. But I try to be fucking rational, and I try to be fucking fair on everything. You know, if I believe something, and it turns out it's not true, you know, hey, I guess I'm going to have to reevaluate my fucking position. That's all there is to it. Some stuff I know for a fact. Others, well, it's opinion, and it's through my own personal experience, through what I've seen, what I've read, etc., I've made up my fucking mind, but I'm still open to hearing other people's opinions on it. There are many things like that. Anyway, I did happen to get um, a lot of comments. I got a couple comments, um, one of which I can remember, and I'm not going to say usernames on here or anything like that. You know, if they unsubscribe from me, that's fine. You know, that's their fucking choice. I'm not saying they have to. I'm not going to beg them to come back, um, but I'm just going to say some of the comments I remember, because I, I did get some good ones, like someone's like, huh, why'd this get, get so many fucking dislikes? I thought it was a good video. Someone asked me, well, actually someone said, you don't understand atheism. Really? Oh, I don't. Okay. And by the way, this is probably going to turn into a long ass fucking video. I have been an atheist since, according to my dad, I was about four or five years old. I questioned God before I questioned Santa Claus. And I was always, oh, what's this Jesus guy and all this? And... Something just never clicked with me. I never believed in God. I tried. You know, I was like, I want to, you know, I, I want to be like the other kids. You know, like every other fucking kid, usually. Um, and I wanted to believe it. Really tried. Something didn't click. I didn't believe in God. That's it. There's just, there's nothing. I mean, I've heard all of the arguments from just about every fucking group. I've read about other religions. I just don't believe in it. Now, that being said, um, I had to point out. And I actually did in the video, but I had to point it out again. There are various groups, because the whole thing is ideology, and this is going to come up a few times in this video. Um, there are various groups of people, um, ideologies, that don't believe in God. So, yeah, it's like they're still atheists, right? Yeah, they are. Atheism just means you don't believe in God. That's all. Now, in all fairness, atheism by itself can, yeah, just be, there's no ideology, you don't believe in God. However, most of the time, well, I shouldn't say most of the time, a lot of times, and I'm going to bring up a few examples in this video, uh, that's, not, that's not the fucking case. Now, here's some examples. World Church of the Creator, I mentioned them before. They are a racist organization. Uh, they're atheists. They actually say this. They do not believe in God. But their religious beliefs are this. White people are the superior race. That's it. That's what they believe. You know, through nature, white people have come out on top. They're the best. That's why they call themselves World Church of the Creator. Because supposedly white people were, uh, I guess I'm included in this, we're the only ones that make anything. We're the only ones that do anything great. The rest of civilization, they suck compared to white civilizations. They're mud people. They suck. They're atheists. Now, is atheism, does that play a big role in it? In a way, yes. They believe in evolution. They don't believe in God. They're atheists. So, yeah, that plays a role. Does that mean that all atheists believe in that? No. Scientologists, that's another fucking group. They don't believe in God. Now, 
Is that an ideology? Yes. Like the creators, that's an ideology. Is it based around atheism? Well, yeah. I mean, Scientology, yeah. It's like there were aliens and shit, you know, thetans and all that bullshit. I'm not going to go into detail. And yes, I know what Scientology is all about. But, yeah, that's atheism in a way. I mean, they don't believe in God, right? Yeah, so they're atheists. So, yes, they are fucking atheists, okay? Um, another group. Now, in all fairness, this group, they can be theist or atheist. But, moving on, uh, that is... Um, Randy and Objectivists. Uh, they basically make their lives revolve around the teachings of Ayn Rand. Um, like I said, there can be theists too, which it kind of fucks with me because Ayn Rand was an atheist and, you know, it was kind of against the Bible. Like, there's that group, the Young Cons, and in some of their fucking videos, they're talking about Atlas Shrugged. It's like, that's kind of going against, especially since one of the members of that group, his name is Sirius C., He's seriously conservative and seriously Christian. Kind of goes against a lot of what Christ taught, but whatever. And like I said, either group you know, can be a part of this, but they basically turn it into a religion, essentially, an ideology. You know, they base their lives around the ideals and ideas of one fucking person and that person's fucking book. Well, books, I should say. She had like, what, 14 books? Which leads me in to another group. Which is kind of based, which kind of deals with atheism and Randian objectivism. And that group <clears throat> is Satanists. Satanism is atheistic. Now, I got some questions on my video about Satanism, of course, because people they didn't bother watching the fucking video. In fact, I even got attacked on that video. Like, eh, how can you be, you know, a Satanist? How can you believe in Satan without, you know, believing in God? And I'm like, watch the fucking video, and you'll find out. And it kept going, and he basically said, well, you people believe this. And I'm like, what do you mean, you people? I mean, I'm a fucking atheist, you idiot. Later on, he admitted, I meant you theists. Okay, well, I'm not a fucking theist, you idiot. Had you watched the video, you would have understood. Satanists do not believe in God. While we're on that, Satanism is atheism, but it basically looks at Christianity. Christianity represents, you know, this shit, that shit, whatever. You know, Christ represents this. Christ and God represent this. Well, some of that shit goes against human nature. So Satanists say, no, Satan represents the opposite, right? According to, you know, the Bible, it's the opposite. So Satanists basically worship the idea that God said this, but Satan is saying this. And you look at that as a symbol and say, that's how I'm going to fucking live my life. The opposite of this fucking hypocritical shit. Now, I'm not a Satanist anymore. I The more I read into it, like even someone recently, I think it was yesterday, put a, a comment on my video of Satanism saying it was ripped off of Ragnar Redbeard's uh, Might is Right, which was very racist. It was just very brutal. It was fucked up. And yeah, of course I fucking know that. I read a lot into Satanism. You know, I consider myself a Satanist for quite a few years. But, you know, I don't believe in the shit. Nonetheless, they are fucking atheists. Now, that brings me to the whole thing. Atheism is not an ideology. It's not. Okay, just like theism, by itself, is not necessarily an ideology. I've met plenty of fucking people who say they don't believe in religion. They believe in God. They just, they don't believe all this religious shit. They think it's fucking dogmatic. They think it's hypocritical. They think it's fucked up. And same with atheists. You know, some atheists say they don't believe in religion because it's dogmatic, it's fucked up, etc., etc. Just atheists say, I don't believe in God. Some theists say, I believe in God. I think something made all of us, which I think, okay, well, that's what you believe, that's fine, whatever. So yes, of course, I accept the fact that a lot of atheists on here are non-religious. They don't have an ideology when it comes to atheism, because atheists are kind of a weird group. Uh, you don't have to be a liberal or a conservative or a Democrat, Republican, uh, gay, straight. You don't have to be any of this to be an atheist. The only thing that all of us have in common, there's one thing, you know, whether that we have an ideology or not, whatever, is that we do not believe in God. Now, some atheists, yes, they follow a certain religion or ideology. That's fine. You know, and that's all I was fucking saying. Apparently, people were not getting that. I didn't see how the fucking point was that hard to fucking get. That's all I was saying. I was saying, yes, some atheists believe this shit, others do not. Some atheists just say, I'm not religious, 
I've looked into religion, or some haven't, they just say, I don't believe it, I think it's fucking bullshit, I'm not even gonna look that much into it, because I think it's all fucking fairy tale nonsense, whatever. Me, along with a few others, have looked into it, some of us have looked, I mean, like, uh, it's the Superfly. He was a, bib a biblical scholar, I think Matt Dillahunty was too, these guys study the fucking Bible, at one time, they considered themselves Christian, so, yeah, you know, there's those atheists too. There are different types of atheists. I guess that point was missed on some people, but I guess since it seemed like I was attacking atheism, I got a bunch of fucking hate for it. Which, you know, whatever. I mean, if that's really how you're going to be, you know, you're not even going to listen to the fucking message, you know, from someone who you were subscribed to, who up until this point you were fine with, oh, but, oh, fuck him. Which kind of, it, it reminds me of like my whole liberal thing. You know, like when I said, you know, liberals are just willing to just, just say, fuck this guy, fuck him. Oh, he's going against this. Whatever. Now, another point that was brought up, uh, this was early and I was, uh, this was like right after I uploaded the video and I was kind of drunk at the time because um, I was waiting for it to upload. I was just drinking and some comments came up. Someone asked me, well, if you think all religion is bullshit, which I do, by the way, um, then why aren't you an anti-theist. Now, there's quite a few points I could bring up, which, by the way, if I'm wiping my head, it's because it's fucking hot. Uh, it's getting humid again. It cooled down, but, of course, it's getting humid again. But anyhow, there are a few points. Number one, I am not an extremist at all on just about anything, you know, because I don't think that whatever I think is fucking right, and that's it. Everyone else is an asshole. That's not the way I am. So, yeah, that's one fucking thing I can say. Number two, I've met quite a few people who believed in religion, some kind of religion, that were great people. Um, here's an example, and I meant to bring this up with the Satanism thing. Um, I knew a guy. He was like me. He was you know, born atheist. You know, he, he didn't believe it. Like me, something didn't click. Um, and before I met him, his, uh, his parents, they were raising him quite religious. Um, and a bunch of shit happened. And I'm not going to go into it. Because it is kind of fucked up, but then again, he said it, and it's like, well, maybe I should respect that, and I know he's never probably going to see this video, but nonetheless, um, his parents did some shit that was based on their religion, and after that, he basically decided that Christianity was fucked up. Not only did it fuck with his life, it fucks with everyone else's lives. And he started looking into Satanism. Because, like I said, he was already an atheist. And he was asking me about it, you know. And I told him, here's what it is. And at the time, I was a Satanist. And basically, he went to that extreme. He said, I'm a fucking Satanist. Was he a good guy? Yeah. And I haven't talked to him for quite some time. But when I knew him, he was a fine person. I just, I think he got a little too into the anti-religious shit. Anyway, moving on. And I guess I can kind of use that point. I don't think that you know religious people are dumb. Uh, religions I find interesting. You know, I mean, I look at it as mythology, just like I look at Greek mythology. Uh, at one time, people believed it. It was some people, and now they don't. They look at it as just a myth. Maybe Christianity will be at that point sometime in human history. I don't know. Who the fuck knows? But I can look at it and appreciate it for what it is. I don't have to believe it. Also. Since that's basically the stance I should take, right? I mean, that I've come, I've sorted this out. So basically, what I, I, what I need to do now is I need to go shouting from the fucking rooftops, telling everyone else how to live, right? That's what I should do because I'm a saint. I mean, sorry, Freudian slip. Uh, I'm an atheist now. That's what I should do. So with that said, since I have basically decided on something, I should basically take the extreme that. I think what other people do, like if they go against me, essentially, I should look at them as assholes, right? Okay, well, what about my vegetarianism? What about that? I decided not to eat meat anymore for moral reasons. I don't want to eat meat because I don't think it's right to do. So what should I do with that? Should I basically be like Onision and say that people that eat meat are fucking assholes? Because they haven't seen the shit that I've seen. They haven't done the research that I've done. And essentially haven't come to the same conclusion that I've come to. Is that fucking fair? 
Is that fair to look at all meat eaters and do that and just judge them and try to tear them down? Is that right to do? In my opinion, it's not. Okay, you have a different fucking belief than I do. There are a few atheists who are vegetarians. You know, I know Krosisborg is, or at least to the best of my knowledge he is. Onision's a fucking vegetarian. There are a few others. I know Coughlin said he fucking tried it. So what, shouldn't, shouldn't we all be like that? Shouldn't we all say, you know, you know, oh yeah, eating meat is wrong. No. Again, all atheists are different. Some of us have ideologies. Some of that is based on atheism. Like me, I don't think that I'm going to a better place. I don't think that the animals that people eat are going to a better fucking place. And for that, I say, I don't want to hurt anyone or anything. I don't want to do that. I don't want to be responsible for the suffering of anyone or anything. That's based on, basically, directly on my fucking atheism. Did everyone draw that same conclusion? No. And I think that's how we need to fucking be. You know, you don't have to respect, you know, because uh, Cardinal Virtues did a video like, he's not going to automatically respect you. And I think that's a fair enough fucking point. You don't have to automatically respect someone from a different uh, school of thought, essentially. Do you have to respect Venom Fang X? No. He's a fucking asshole. He is a 100% fucking prick. There's, like, nothing good about him. At all. He has his fucking ideology. You know, I respect certain Christians, like Stone Commander, he's a friend of mine. Abby Normal one, I like her a lot. Uh, I respect Jesus Freak 777, even though, you know, he said some shit, you know, against atheists. But then again, in all fairness, atheists have said shit against him. So it's kind of like, yeah, whatever. Together for Peace, he's another Christian, you know, he called Venifang, out, uh, Venifang X out on that shit with the DMCA uh, years ago. So I respect these guys. I don't agree with them. But one thing that fucks me up is, um, you know, why is it that atheists, some atheists seem to think that we all need to agree with each other, that we're all in this fucking group. We all need to support each other. Now, with things like the, um, the Reason Rally, I understand that, you know, it's, a atheists are still a pretty fucking big minority in this country. Like, we're one of the biggest. And, like, the Reason Rally, I look at it as, like, the gay pride thing. Um, like the gays, they're not saying everyone should be uh, gay. Because gays are weird like that. Like, they don't give a fuck if the entire planet turns gay. It doesn't affect them. They're just saying, here's who we are. We're fucking proud of who we are. And I didn't attend that. And it wasn't for any kind of ideological reason. It was because, well, I couldn't get out of work. Plus, I'm not driving all the way to fucking D.C. to do it. Even though it would have been cool to meet some people. But, I get that. But all of us are completely fucking different. You know, when I attack Thunderfoot. Yeah, I got a bunch of hate from that, of course. You know, because Thunderfoot lovers, they're, you know, going to support him no matter what he says or does. But other people are like, yeah, fuck him. You know, he's being an asshole. He's being an ideologue. That's all he's fucking doing. No, atheism is the best. You know, if, if any religious country, they fucking suck. You know, any religious person, they're idiots and they, you know, well, yeah, some are okay, but, you know, for the most part, no. And, you know, that's one of the reasons I stopped watching Bionic Dance because it's like every fucking video, it's talking about religion and why religion is dumb. And, like I said, I have no problem with her as a person. I have a problem with her anti-theism. I, I'm already an atheist. You're preaching to the fucking choir. I don't need to hear this anymore. I already know this. Yes, I don't believe that. Yes, I know a lot of religious people believe this or that. Or they think that, you know, homosexuality is fucking disgusting. And abortion is murder. All of this shit. I don't need to fucking hear it. Maybe some atheists are, you know, kind of new in the game. Like, they just lost religion and they want to hear it. And that's fine. Me? No. You know, I would much rather watch an atheist do, like, videos on science, like Evo Gen Videos or Lithodid Man, Wildwood Claire, um, Potholer 54. I'd much rather see that. Or then just talk about themselves. You know, like, oh yeah, here's what I believe on this issue. I'd much rather hear that. You know, I don't need to hear why religion is fucking stupid. I don't believe in religion. Okay, there you go. I don't need it. Just like I don't need to watch videos from Onision saying why I shouldn't eat meat. I don't. And I think Onision just got to the point where it's like, yeah, okay, I get it. You think eating meat is fucking evil. You think meat eaters are bad people. Great. 
are you going to talk about anything else? Well, in all fairness, he talks about himself, his relationships, uh, vegetarianism, and why meat eaters are evil, uh, stirs up drama, you know, just basically shit about him. You know, his fucking worldview and how, why everyone else should basically love him and believe everything he fucking says. But I don't know why this was such a hard fucking video to swallow for some people. You know, I know what atheism is, and I'm saying these people are atheists too. And also, even if we got rid of the religious atheists, the ones who have ideologies, beyond that, we still divide each other up. We still do that. You know, there's the whole fucking thing between atheists. There's like strong atheists versus agnostic or weak atheists. You know, there's atheists like me who say, well, I don't think we're ever going to be able to disprove God, especially with the rules that have been set up, which, by the way, that's the fault of the fucking theist, because, they, well, God, he was in the clouds. Okay, we got up to the clouds. There's no God here. That, well, God's in space. We got up in space. There's no God here. Oh, well, God is, uh, he's uh, in this black hole. And, no, still not. Well, God's in a different dimension. It's like it's outside of time and space. So with that rule being set up, we can't really disprove it, which is fine. I don't fucking care if we can prove or disprove it. But then there's the strong atheists who judge people like me. It's the same with the fucking vegans who judge me for just being a vegetarian. Well, you still eat cheese and blah, blah, blah. It's the same fucking thing. I'm not going to hate people simply because they don't fucking agree with me. That's not the way I am. I try to be fucking fair. I try to look at people as individuals rather than what they believe. Unless it's something really fucked up. Like, this race, through nothing that they've done, they're inferior. I don't look at religious people like, well, you're a Christian, so that means you're responsible for the fucking atrocities of this group. Because, again, you can bring up atheists who have done bad shit. But that doesn't mean all atheists believe that it's the right thing to do or that it's good. Just like not all Christians believe that some things that religion has done is good. It, how fucking much clearer can I get? So I hope this long ass video, however fucking long it was, cleared some things up. And whether people come back or whether they even fucking bother watching, I really don't fucking care. Because I'm not going to fucking stoop to that level of hating religious people because they believe in religion which I disagree with. So anyway, I've fucking gone on long enough. This is a bad five and I'll see you guys next video.